What's up guys? So sorry I have been absent for a little while. I had been so busy with school and studying that I have not been filming much. So today I'm going to finally do another eating video. And today I have some Amici's lasagna. Let me open this up. Amici's is a chain that has some Italian food like calzones, manicon, I can't, I can't pronounce this right, manicani, some lasagna, spaghetti and meatballs, and just traditional Italian dishes like their pizzas and stuff. But I personally prefer to but get their baked lasagna. It is my favorite. Sorry, I'm just butchering my words. Haven't done this for a while, so I'm kind of nervous. Anyways, let me just show you guys. This is the lasagna I'm about to eat. I got extra mozzarella cheese on mine. And I am really starved, so I'm gonna just go ahead and grub. And I have some diet root beer. One time I opened the diet root beer at work and the fizz just went everywhere. Oh, this feels so good. Now I can speak again. I was just so busy and tired because I was setting up my new Epson EcoTank printer and I literally had to watch a video on how to put in the ink because it didn't specify that you had to kind of turn it to the side to pour it in. Anyways, installing one printer was a hassle enough for me. Well, now let me dig in into my lasagna. Ooh, so much cheese. Oh, God. Look at this. I'm going to burn my tongue. Ah, so good. I was starving. Love this. This is good when you eat it and it's warm. Just so good. Mm. Wow, that was a nice cheese pull. Some napkin. I got some Parmesan cheese too. Creating a little mountain here. Sorry if I'm being cut off. I'm still getting used to the setup. And I'm cold, so I'm wearing my red shawl. Been watching a lot of YouTube videos on random things.
like I was watching a YouTube video on the first couple of days of when you have a baby of how it's born in the hospital, how they bring it to the mother and how it has to stay on he or she gets the contact with her mother and their skins have to touch in order for them to bond better. Like I can't imagine when a mom is just give birth gives birth and it's kind of a good moment but I in a way it's a moment that you can't adjust to because something is different anyways. I don't know if that's the feeling most moms get but to me i would feel very nervous and i would feel like i don't know what to do and just have a very shocking moment like my life has just changed with the um, babies coming in and all the visitors uh standing outside I would feel as if I don't want anybody to come in to see me at that moment. So. And they say that babies' behaviors aren't, bore, aren't formed until they're six months. So it's okay to spoil and hold a baby as much as you want until they turn six months. See guys, lots of meat and ricotta cheese inside. Nearly burned my hand. I put it under this plate because I was taking it to my car. It's a good thing Amici's is close to my house. That way the food doesn't get cold on the way home. know what else I've been wanting to try? Pork pockets. Funny enough, I've been craving a lot of pig. Those poor piglets out there. I've been craving ribs, ham, and pork chops. Well, not really pork chop, mostly ribs. And shredded pork. Just wondering though if pork pockets is a Chinese thing or Korean thing. Again, my nose is leaking. I also have the ideas of doing a video on my favorite junk food as a kid or not junk food but sweets like I was at Target the other day and I came across little Debbie's cosmic brownies and I remember I used to eat that when I was in junior high but in kindergarten 
I remember eating the Little Debbie's brownies with wallets, with walnuts, or the frosted brownies with walnuts on the way to school. What's left? Wow, I'm just chowing down. Getting super full. Super, super full. Well, alrighty guys, thank you for watching my video. Have a good rest of your day. See you guys in my next video. Bye.